Hala Park is a home for lost and orphaned wildlife. Located in Mombasa town in Kenya, Hala Park in Mombasa was named in honor of Dr. Rin Hala. It is found along the Mombasa Malindi Highway. Welcome to the unbelievable nature story of Hala Park. Hala Park is a habitat for many mammals and the oryx is one of them. Distinguished by its straight horns, it lives close to the water bodies. Also found at Hala Park are the hippopotamus. They are highly aggressive and not predictable animals. Despite the huge shape and short legs, they are capable of outrunning a human being, especially over short distances. And that is why at Hala Park, they are always enclosed and fed. The giraffe is the tallest animal in Hala Park and in the whole entire world. At Hala Park, you enjoy a great scene while viewing these giraffes. At Hala Park, antelopes are safe from any kind of predator. Here, it is amazing to see the great bond with these sheep and they always enjoy each other's company. These are the younger tortoises at Hala Park. This is a place where you find the oldest tortoises in the whole of Africa. The hard shell on their back protects them from being harmed by other creatures. A variety of snake species is found at Hala Park. There is the bush snake. Also found at Hala Park, Mombasa, are the strip-bellied sand snakes. The water bugs are found here too. They are very beautiful creatures. This is a female water bug and unlike the males, they usually have no horns. They feed on grass and other green vegetation. At Hala Park, this salamander and turtle share a pool of water and it is just amazing to see them swimming together. Also known for the waters is a calm yet very fierce predator. It has a good streamlined body which enables it to swim very well in water. At times, crocodiles move to the ground and open their mouths as they bask. Hala Park is a home to many zebras. They are strong animals and belong to the horse family. They are known for their black and white striped skin. Millipedes rustle through the dry leafy droppings from the vegetation for food and are responsible for breaking down fungi and enriching the soil with nutrients. There is a wide variety of them. This is a red-legged millipede. You cannot miss the monkeys at Halapa. Monkey types found at Halapa, Kenya include the vavet. You can tell by the black faces and the gray color. The tilapia occupy a water ponds here at Hala Park and the beautiful colored butterflies are simply amazing. 
trees live in a world of their own. They have succulent leaves which generate the atmosphere with oxygen for respiration. If not for the trees and the vegetation at Hala Park, there would be no life to this park. Hala Park is a big man-made forest with a variety of trees in it. They include the barbab trees known for the hollow part inside their stems. Their leaves do not have a lot of stomata because they need to preserve the little water that is available for them. Also found here are the palm trees which dry up leaves at times when it is very hot in order to reduce the rate of water loss thus are able to thrive in these conditions throughout the season. Also found here is the fig tree and it is a thrilling nature story to find it here. The forest has short and tall trees. The short trees intertwine themselves on the bigger ones in order for them to reach to sunlight and make energy for themselves. They are mainly softwood and are able to grow fast and get very tall. It is not easy here and trees have to spread their roots wide for their own support. Shrubs and other vegetation are found at Halapak. You will not expect such green leaves in this tropical climate. At Hala Park, it is cool that we find a flowering plant despite the harsh salty water environment. Their flowers are similar to other natural flowers exhibiting a sweet fragrance. The water bodies at Halapa provide the vegetation and the animals with water which is a very vital element of life. There are no natural water bodies at Halapa and all of them are man-made. They not only provide shelter to the terrestrial plants but also to some animals. What is amazing is how all this water has been gathered around and how the animals and plants use it for their growth. There are artificial ponds where fish are bred. Great bones like this of Mze, the tortoise, and Owen, the orphaned hippo, have left many explorers bewildered, and that was only a beginning. Nature is still showing its love to this game sanctuary, and more orphans will find their way to Hala. Not even time will stop this from going all the way to the top. Jeniferiet, 
Chuki na ukabila Hatutaki hata kamwe Lazima tungane Tuijenge inchi yetu Pasiwe hata moja Anae tenganisha Naishi na tumaini Na ditole ya daima Kenya Hakika ya bendera Ni utabiti wangu Nyeusi ya wana Inaji contract Alafi na kontrazo Bulipana Eda inainua Fanya Alina Mungu ni mwese Alisema tuzi ya pezi kambi ya Kenya Mwana nchi mzale ndo Uchungu na mateso Kwa bilio na huzuni 